Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The vision of Doral Academy Charter Middle High School is to set the standard for outstanding student achievement while providing a safe and nurturing academic environment. Good, Good morning, morning Firebirds. Firebirds! I can't believe August is already coming to an end. I know, it feels like it just started. There's so much more to look forward to in this upcoming month. Agreed. Now, before we begin on today's show, joining you for the first time, I'm Noah Rico. And I'm Nick Corabal. Today's August 29th, and this is... Firebird, Firebird TV. TV! Three, two, one. Nicole, do you know what's better than 10 state-of-the-art parks? What? 10.5 state-of-the-art parks. With Central Park officially opening, you can take the weekend to visit the skate park, amphitheater, kayak launch, fishing pier, and much more. I wish I could interact with everyone. How so? I mean, I want to know what everyone thinks. If only I could read minds. <laughs> well, that definitely won't happen. But in this week's edition of Man on the Street, you can take a look into the minds of students here at Doral Academy. Good morning, Firebirds. I'm Sofia Pinto, and today we're going to ask people about their favorite and least favorite trends. Hi, who am I here with? Gianna. Gianna, what's your favorite trend at the moment? Um, just give me my money. I thought you were going to say least favorite. Can I say my least favorite? Yeah, least favorite. Le least favorite right now? I hate, like, the demure. I hate it. Is it because you're not demure? No, like, I am, but, like... What yeah. is that? Marco? Walk through the middle, don't hey, worry. Marco, come here. What's your least favorite trend? Demure, bro. You see? It's because you guys aren't demure. No, like, it's just like annoying. Step and say that again. I hate you. Who am I here with? I'm here, no, you're here with Dinesh Chantel Gonzalez. And what's your favorite trend? My favorite trends right now are slick bags because it's a clean way to hide the dirty and greasy hairs when you're having a bad hair day and it just makes you look put together. Did you wash your hair last night? Yes. That's why you don't have a slick back? Yeah, so if not, catch me with a slick back. Now you know, if she's dirty, she has a slick back. Who am I here with? Michelle. And what's your favorite trend at the moment? Pickleball. Are you good? Oh yeah. Are you lying? No. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's all for today, Firebirds. I'm going to enjoy some lunch with my friends. Bye! I've been in the school for a while now, but I still feel very lost. There's so many events going on. Oh yeah, for sure. With so much going on in my little agenda, I cannot fit anything, and I forget everything. Good thing we have here at Firebird TV our announcements. Next Monday, September 2nd, will be a teacher planning day. An open house will be hosted on Saturday, September 6th. Make sure to attend if you would like further information about the school year. Remember, homecoming tickets are now on sale. Make sure to visit the Doral Academy Instagram for more information. There will be a Model UN informational meeting on September 5th at 2.30 for high school at 3.30 for middle school in room 506H. It's truly really amazing to see the work in our community to help others. I mean, how wonderful it is that people take out of their time to support our community. The community paramedic program allows us to go out to the community centers and offer wellness checks to those residents. The program also allows us to go out to the residents' homes that are not able to go out to the community centers. And once we're there, we can offer wellness checks and pair them up with any type of resources that they may need. Community paramedics are the heartbeat of our neighborhoods, providing care and support, keeping our residents safe and healthy. So during the wellness checks, we'll check the residents' pulse rate, saturation of oxygen, their blood pressure, and their glucose if they, if they so choose. And we can also give information in reference to the medications if they ask. So after the wellness check, we'll give them a wellness card with all their vitals and a date stamp. And they can use that as a record whenever they go to their doctor's appointment. Day or night, they are willing to put everything aside and are ready to assist our residents anytime they have emergencies. These wellness checks are very important because there may be gaps in between the doctor's appointments. Prevention is the most important thing within our wellness checks and we're very proud to go out to the community and keep them safe.
Wow, that was such an uplifting story. The support and care for each other was very admirable. It truly is. And talking about support, let's make sure we do not lack that in this new season in our Firebird Sports. Good morning, Firebirds. I'm Ryan Lamal with today's sports report. Last night, our Firebird football team took home a victory against Matter Academy. The final score was 37-20. Our star quarterback, number 4, Jordan Yale, had 4 touchdowns and 2 passing yards. In other news, our girls golf team has a game today at 7am in Grand Palms against Lady Mavericks. Good luck, Firebirds. Our volleyball team has an away game tomorrow at 2pm against Orangewood Christian. Lastly, our cross-country team will be competing this Saturday at 7.30 a.m. against Park Vista Cobra at Boca Raton. I'm Ryan Lamar with today's sports update. Now let's hand things back over to our anchors. That concludes our daily show, Firebirds. If you haven't already, make sure to follow us on all social media platforms at Firebird TV, and we hope you have a, a thrilling, thrilling Thursday. Thursday.